there was a bit of worry there for a minute that WB would pull a WB and screw up a perfectly good thing because, hey, that's what WB has been doing. So for a while, we all worried that Scorpion was not returning for Mortal Kombat 2. Well, he is, and the original actor is returning as well, so rejoice. <laughs> So we of course know that Mortal Kombat 2 is right now in post-production and they're hoping to reveal some stuff based on the film by the end of the year. We of course don't have a release date or anything like that and chances are it's going to remain in a bit of limbo till WB feels comfortable finding a good slot for it. Whatever the case is, there was a lot of worry that Scorpion would not be returning, especially due to the fact that he wasn't really a giant highlight of the first film like he kind of faded into the background for a large part of it to make room for Cole and well when it comes to the actor who plays him Hiroyuki Sonata he of course has been finding success all over the place recently and if you guys have seen of course his new show Shogun for Disney and FX seems to be making a lot of waves so a lot of people doubted whether or not he would be in MK2. The good thing is during a interview for the upcoming Mortal Kombat 2, speaking with Carl Urban, he says, yeah, we finished shooting in Australia recently. And when asked about shooting the film with stars from the first film, such as Sonata, he confirmed, yes, you did shoot with him. Thus now confirming to us that, yeah, he's in the film. Now, a lot of people are worried that this is one of those things where he's going to have a minor role. And I could honestly see that. I think Mortal Kombat 2 is going to be a different style of MK film, and I think it's going to set up a third film. I wouldn't even be surprised if there's like spin-offs or an attempt to do it on TV as well, like uh, you know, multimedia this franchise and this continuity. So this isn't surprising to me, but I will say I do think it's a little worrying that he was never announced as a core part of the cast or anything like that. It makes me think it's just going to be an extended cameo or one-off appearance and then set up his next appearance, which if that's the case... We'll see how it's handled when the film comes out. It would be disappointing, but hopefully it's in the story and not just, well, he's here for a minute, then he's gone. But we got him on the posters to hype you up because that would be disappointing.